Anthony and Faith, I know that this road hasn't been easy for you and it's been a lot longer than you had anticipated or even <laughs> expected. But by actually showing true and genuine love for one another, that others were able to see that, Anthony, as you were patient, as Faith, you were patient, as you showed kindness and you showed kindness to one another, that what ultimately everyone saw truly was a love of Jesus Christ. We are so happy to watch Anthony and Faith's relationship grow as they learn to support each other. We are so pleased with your presence here today to share our joy at this precious and the important moment of our lives. When Faith was young, she was very gentle and obedient. To put your trust in God. And number two, to find the right girl and marry her. And so I had this brilliant idea of a no boys period for a whole year. So no dating, focusing on yourself and loving yourself. And we we're so pumped up. We we're like, yeah, yeah, let's do this. Like not even two months, I don't think. She's like, Anthony confessed. I was like, oh, he knows you're in the no boys period, right? And she's like, yeah. I'm like, and he still confessed? She's like, yeah. That's so beautiful. Wait, 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 don't smash my clothes. <laughs> okay. no. Are you crying? Yeah. I love it. Good. Yeah. Do, do a twirl. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so good. Wow. Oh. And so let us pray. Gracious Father, we thank you for the gift of your love through your Son, Jesus Christ. And we ask you, Holy Spirit, to come and bless all who are gathered here as witnesses of this marriage covenant between Anthony and Faith. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. My sister has been my role model ever since I was a baby. I copied so many things she did and she never really minded. When I was stressed, the first person I thought of to call was my sister. In high school, when Anthony would pick me up in his white Toyota Prius and we would talk until 3 a.m. or until he ran low on gas. We talked about everything from girls to more serious things like our faith and relationship with God. I went through a difficult stretch in college and I didn't really know who to talk to but Anthony was always there for me, lending a listening ear and offering advice. And that's something he always does for those around him. I was so overcome at how wonderful of a gift God had given me through faith. She was the first person to fulfill the promise that God would provide a community for me. Um, and I've made it through the last decade because I've had faith. With this ring, I be what as my soul will bow to you this day. In the name of the Father, the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. I now pronounce you husband and wife. And so this is now the moment, Anthony, you've been waiting for. You may now kiss your bride. And what God has brought together, let no one separate.
talking to Angel and I was like, what am I exactly supposed to talk about during a best man speech? And she said, you're supposed to talk about how he's changed since knowing or being in a relationship with Faith. So my gut reaction was, he hasn't changed. <laughs> So many of the times when I've seen Anthony at his happiest have been when he's been with you. I mean, we just saw that in the ceremony like two hours ago. From my interactions with both of you, you are truly the best person that he could have chosen to spend the rest of his life with. I know that your life with him will be a blast as he's brought so much joy and laughter in life. Let's raise a glass to Faith and Anthony for a happy life together and many adventures to come. <laughs>